2022. I'm so happy to be back. And as some of you know, it's been absolutely a crazy, bumpy road for me in 2021. But I'm really positive that 2022 is going to be a really amazing year for all of us. Okay, so. Um, I was reading uh, some of your comments and one of you suggested that we do energy check for you and your loved one for each of the zodiac signs. So this is what I'm going to do. Uh, we're going to go through all of the zodiac signs starting with Aries with the fire signs and um, we're going to see what is happening between you and your loved one. Now remember that this is going to be a short and quick kind of like an energy check for you and the person on your mind okay and that could be your soulmate could be your twin fame whoever that is in your heart and whoever that you love so deeply and have a soul connection with okay so uh let's uh, start this reading and uh this is going to be a new format so please bear with me as um we're going to be going through it this is going to be for aries okay so i'm going to put the aries here so that um i know what reading we are doing okay so Aries let's see what is going on between you and your loved one let's take a look at the energies all right we are going to see what is going on and I'm also going to be posting on the membership site for all the zodiac signs yearly forecast so stay tuned for that I'm going to start with um, air signs um, in the membership site okay so if you're interested you can um, uh, you can sign up at the membership at my membership site as some of you know I launched it um, this uh, last year in August all right my loves okay so Aries what is going on between you and your person we're gonna get um, one card for you and one card for your person okay and um, and, and the energy of the union so and as i said it's going to be quick so we have a white tailed deer okay so this is for you aries and it says pause assess and then act all right and uh, we also have renew your life okay sea eagle wow this is powerful this is for your person fire so it could be another fire sign uh, it could be like a Leo because there's a sun here but okay and the energy of the Union we have appreciate the process cow and bull all right so it could be also a Taurus so Taurus energy um, another fire sign is being showed up now let's see what is going on now for you Aries I feel like you've been kind of like pausing on the relationship you haven't been um, taking any action you've been just like quietly waiting maybe for the right time um, maybe even like um, you've been waiting for um, to see like when you can act on the relationship for some of you I feel like you just um, pulled your energy back for a while I feel like you're not feeling um, the way that you felt since the beginning that perhaps you met this person right now you are feeling perhaps very calm very kind of like detached from the situation or from this relationship at the time but at the same time I feel like you are gathering all of your energy you are you know it's almost like a deer like hiding um, in the forest be before like you are kind of like looking to see if there's no predators and things like that you're just like quietly observing your surroundings okay this is beautiful and um, and it has uh you know it looks like there is like a family of the deers because there is a stag and there is like a male and female or there is like masculine and feminine and there is like a child here okay now what spirit is telling me is that i feel like you are um you have a dream you have something that you want to have with this person maybe you want to have a family with them maybe you're imagining something but you're putting a pause on it and I feel like the reason for it is that you want to reassess things you want to make sure that this is exactly what you want because I feel like maybe when you were going for it you've been kind of like um, faced with a lot of closed doors all right so I feel like this is your energy right now maybe for some of you you are parents I don't know maybe for some of you you have like you have children or you are like single parents okay for some of you that you are watching this and also for some areas it could be that deer or stag is your spirit animal that's being showed up to give you this message now for your person what is going on here is that 
I feel like your person is going for it, okay? I feel like they want to go, um, they want to come and get you, all right? I feel like they've been um, going through some kind of a transformation. And this eagle looks like a phoenix to me. Um, usually, um, when this card shows up, I see it mostly like looks like a phoenix because look at the eagle. I mean, it has all of these fire and um, it's, you know, there's the sun. So, you know, to me, this looks like, uh, like a phoenix you know and because it says renew your life i feel like this person wants to just act on the relationship whereas you don't want maybe for you you put a pause but for them they want to act okay they want to go for it um i feel like um for some aries perhaps you also have pisces in your chart i don't know but for some of you i feel like this person is um going for um something it's like uh, you know they've been targeting you for a really really long time and now they are acting upon their passion something has been changed in the life of your person i feel like they are um the energies could have been like kind of reversed right now for you aries where before you wanted to act i feel like now you are assessing things you are waiting perhaps for this person to contact you first okay and then see whether you want it or not so this is the situation that i'm seeing for you guys okay it could be another fire sign or a water sign it could be also pisces especially is being emphasized now there's also taurus okay so the energy of the union i feel like both of you um reaching a point where you are perhaps understanding that there is a process behind this condition not to rush it not to push it not to um maybe for some of you you've been expecting it to happen at the same at, at, at a certain time but now both of you are really appreciating the way that things has been even though it has been um pretty challenging maybe for some of you um i feel like you know how this um and it says cow and bull which is very interesting i feel like your you know your person could also be a tourist with aquarius in their charts okay this is another thing that i'm also seeing what i'm also seeing here is that i feel like you two have been going through this process for lifetime after lifetime so this is not your first time doing this i feel like both of you right now reaching a point where you are really more appreciating the process as opposed to like trying so hard to get where you want to go okay um this is what i'm seeing i'm seeing a lot of past life a lot of past life like um you two have been doing this over and over together okay this is not your first time doing this um past life in egypt um i'm seeing some of that for for you guys okay so let me see what else for you aries and then um okay let's um let's get some of these cards and see let me move them a little bit here and you see like how cows or you know bull they really enjoy like they are not they, they are never in rush okay when you see them like eating something like you know this cow is like you know or this bull is like eating a grass it's not going to be rushing towards it like they take their time to um eat to enjoy to digest <coughs> so i feel like this has been the case for the both of you like you two are not going to be um maybe in the beginning there was such a rush to get there but now it's mostly like just appreciating what is happening right now or what has been going on in the process of this journey that you have with your person okay so let's see um let's see what else is going on for you and your loved one okay so what do we got do we have the uh, the judgment okay and it says um you have achieved a level of clarity and composure that allows you calmly evaluate yourself and your choices in order to make positive decisions oh my goodness this is just a little bit too crazy but this is you aries okay and there is a mirror here um you know that in judgment is usually not that you know this is not like a very usual uh judgment card because um it's showing a girl looking in the mirror so for some of you definitely this is your twin fame okay you've been kind of like reassessing but you're getting a lot of clarity um i feel like you guys are getting a lot of clarity on what you really want to do 
um, evaluating and this is exactly what is happening because it says um, pause assess and act okay so beautiful um, I feel like for a lot of you you're also accepting yourself perhaps this person has been um, pushing you towards self self love appreciating your body appreciating the process whatever that's happening I feel like for a lot of you guys um, this is what's going on usually judgment card of course it it is that um, that there is that um, past life karma past life lessons however I feel like in this case um, it has to do with you guys um, reassessing okay like um, trying to find um, clarity or evaluating things okay evaluating this is really really beautiful <laughs> okay so this is for you and um, now let's see for your sorry guys I'm taking it upside down <laughs> all right now let's see for your person and we also gonna get one for the union as well okay for your person what is happening we have the star so for some of you yes this could be an aquarius and as i said there is a taurus with aquarius in their chart or it could be that your person is an aquarius and says um you will find yourself feeling very positive motivated and free trust that the universe has a plan for you and trust the feeling you have that everything is going to be okay so yeah i feel like definitely your person your loved one is feeling very very positive as i said they are going for it or they have had some kind of a um, renewal they had experience um, renewal in their life and they're feeling free you see how this eagle see eagle or like you know to me it looks like a phoenix like it's just going for it it's just like they are like feeling like they can do it they have so much hope they're they're feeling like a lot more positive than they have been before i feel like in the past they haven't been taking any action on their relationship but now they're willing to do that okay this is beautiful all right so um that is for that and let's get one for the union and then we are going to go for the next sign after that i'm actually maybe gonna give you guys some charms too i know you guys love charms oh my goodness all right so we have the tower for the energy of the union and says the um the destruction um of destruction on your realistic goals and dreams is always followed by renewal and creation so you know what it tells me is that i feel like you two had experienced separation okay this tower moment has happened for the both of you but now you know they're telling me that this has been a blessing in disguise even though both of you did not want it to be separated from each other but i feel like each of you you know in a different way in your journey have been experiencing something really powerful something really uh, meaningful something that perhaps before meeting each other it was just not possible to see that it was only possible when you meet each other okay and of course you know i feel like the energies has been very powerful for the both of you that this tower moment has happened and everything got collapsed but this is just because all of this destruction all of this chaos has happened in order for bring both of you something new um, and says renewal and creation and especially for your person because you know they have been experiencing this renewal um, in their life um, okay or kind of like resurrection i feel like the energy is feeling like extremely positive yeah extremely positive because there's also the sun in the background um i mean to me like there is the energy of um uh, scorpio there is pisces there is leo okay so there are some uh signs but um, mostly i feel that um this could be another fire sign for some of you guys okay all right so i think that um this is for you guys this is um what i'm seeing let's get you guys some charms too and then we're gonna go to the next side okay all right let's see let's see guys what is going on here okay and because we are like very i wanted these readings to be short so i'm not gonna give too much but remember that i'm also gonna be doing individual um signs so what do we have here is letter e for some you could be um your person's initial or their last name letter g letter n letter a all right and it says twin flame mission so for some of you yes this is your twin flame with the mirror i would see that you are my heart that's what they want to tell you and um yeah twin flame mission okay so 
what else and uh, there is aquarius energy and this is hope i mean guys come on i feel like this is just exactly the energy that um is coming uh, for your relationship there's a lot of hope there's a lot of positivity um of course with the star you know um there is a lot of positive energy coming from this person if in the past they have been very negative i feel like there's a lot of hope and you know they're feeling like more positive than before and um, it also says throat chakra. So I feel like there has been no communication and this person's throat chakra is opening up um, and they're gonna be communicating with you. I want to tell you that I love you too. So maybe you told them that you love them, but they never said anything. And this is coming for you, Aries, okay. What else? It says, um, my thoughts are cloudy. All right, so I feel like perhaps your person has been feeling very confused about it. And this is like kind of, I feel like it, you know, this could have been in the past where they felt very confused about the connection, but I feel like now they wanna say something. And this has to do with their throat chakra, okay? I feel like it could have been um, blocked in a way okay my loves and um it's interesting because we have a lot of oh my god what is that letter y i don't know i think it was um uh maybe attached to one of these cubes but it just fell off so it could be letter y too i don't know if i can um oh goodness i don't know okay i'll do that later maybe i'll just uh because i need to take it off oh my god guys it's just playing with me right now okay i took it off and um for some of you guys i feel like there's going to be communication actually around um winter time uh, whatever that is in your region like it could be that you are if you're in southern hemisphere or you are in northern hemisphere it could be like different timing but this is kind of like a winter timing and there is like a christmas tree <laughs> so for some of you you know perhaps there has been a little bit of a communication around that time we also have scorpio so it could be a confirmation okay for you guys letter q a letter q and year of rabbit is being emphasized and um what else do we have here we have like a lot of um turtles here so i feel like the process could have been like really slow but you know it has it is like something that maybe for you guys you know before like you get to the finish line it's like appreciating the process as opposed to like rushing in you know just to get to where you want to be actually there are three turtles which is very interesting there are three turtles i don't know maybe i feel like there is like this wish of like having a family with this person like you two might have like a family later on with this person actually we also have us so for some of you could be that your loved one is in us or you live there um yeah i mean there is a lot of like reference to um christmas as well and also I feel like you guys are finding the direction or there is like more clarity coming you know I feel like there is more clarity like both of you are getting more clarity on where you are going within the connection and your person could be like um, wearing gloves uh, wearing glasses sorry guys and um, for some of you I'm also seeing like Florida or somewhere like with flamingos like oh my god yeah some of you it's like um and there's middle east as well there's middle east there is us maybe for some of you you guys live there okay so this is it for you aries and um i'm going to switch to um sagittarius okay all right guys i think i'm gonna get a little bit of a break in between them so that i could um, refresh my energy and then gonna start sagittarius too so i don't know if i will i feel like i might um i don't know if i'm gonna have a chance to edit the video or not but if you guys feel like you need to forward it and forward to get to your sign and also there's going to be um timelines like timestamps for these okay this was for aries all right so let's get to sagittarius um let's get to sagittarius and see what is the energy between you and your loved one all right i'm going to put that there 
so that we know that this is for Sagittarius energy okay let me just move it a little bit up there okay so let's uh, start and see what is the energy for Sagittarius okay what is happening for Sagittarius for those of you that you are my members thank you so much for all of your support and your love and for those of you that you're subscribing to the channel also the same thing and also commenting sharing the videos um, I'm very very grateful for this channel it has brought me a lot of um, uh, a, a lot of like good feelings a lot of um, abundance a lot of um, friends a lot of friendships and things like that so um, it's such a blessing to be able to do these readings for you guys okay so let's see guys let's see what is going on for Sagittarius so as I said this before for um, the first sign Aries that we did this is going to be your energy your person's energy and in the middle we are going to have the union energy okay let's see what is going on for Sagittarius it says change your perspective okay this is for you Sagittarius and uh, oh my goodness this one just popped and um, there is a turtle <laughs> and it says find your element and it says sea turtle okay um, it's very interesting because turtle showed up in um, actually three turtles showed up in Aries reading okay and the energy of the union we have discover the pattern all right and this is broad wing um cut it cut it i don't know i feel like it looks like a cricket to me or um, grasshopper <laughs> all right so anyways it has a you know i don't know probably this is like a special name for it okay guys so let's see what is uh, the energy for sagittarius just give me a second here all right Sagittarius now what is going on here for your energy here is that I feel like for a lot of you um, you needed to change your perspective towards this connection for some of you um, perhaps this person actually awakened you okay and now the way that you look at the world is really really different I feel like for some of you I mean to me this looks like a hangman but um, you know what they're telling me is that um, you two showed each other um, the world in a different way perhaps you had this perception you had this perspective about the world around you about love especially and this person really changed all of that it's like you now you have a completely new perspective of what love is or you know how you are relating to this person and things like that okay so this is the energy that i'm seeing and it's very interesting because um you know there are two birds here so i feel like you know it's almost like maybe this person was the cause of this change like they changed something um completely like you know maybe you know right now the way that you're looking is just totally different from what you um knew like the world even like yourself okay maybe even the perception of self um and this is what i'm seeing as your energy and as the energy of your person it says find your element so i feel like your person has been very kind of like uh, i don't know free flowing like not caring like you know what is going on around them just going like kind of like very um slowly towards you and maybe you did not like that maybe you did not like the pace of the relationship and for some of you you really needed to um something needed to change completely in order for you to still kind of like um uh stay within this connection i feel like you two are still um you know connected or you two are still hoping that you can get together however there is that um, confusion on their end i feel like this person didn't know who they really are when they met you okay they just had no idea so they've been kind of like swimming in life or in the sea of life with no direction with nowhere like they wanted to like they didn't know who they are i feel like this turtle it's like 
No, and it says find your element. And what does that mean? Is that trying to find who you are on a soul level. So it could be, and uh, if you know, a water sign is strongly. Maybe they've been very. Um, I feel like this person had has a lot of feelings for you, but they've been very, very confused about who they are. And that's why they haven't been um, perhaps pursuing you because they needed to find themselves. They needed to find, and it says find your element. You know, maybe they thought they are, you know, they're a bird. Maybe they thought they are this or that, but then spirit is showing them that um, this is who they are. I feel like maybe for some of them, they've been even um, ashamed of themselves. For some of them, maybe they've been trying to hide in their shell like not coming out okay and perhaps the communication has been cut off or there has been really slow process between the both of you but i feel like your person is finally finding that okay finding who they really are um of course the you know um the speed of this connection is pretty slow because um you know when a soul is going to you know when someone is going through soul searching it's not going to happen in a day it's not going to happen uh fast it's, it is a process okay so i feel like this person is finding themselves and that's why i feel like um slowly but surely they are coming towards you okay i feel like both of you needed to work um in a you know on yourself in a different way for you sagittarius to changing your perspective towards them or towards life in general and for them to finding who they really are on a soul level now as the energy of the union uh, it says discover the pattern so i feel like you know both of you have been going through this um patterns that keep repeating itself on and on maybe even lifetime after lifetime there could be like a karmic um, pattern or it could be like a lesson that you two needed to learn but um it wasn't completed or it was too challenging and you two keep repeating that until like this time you know this lifetime perhaps you two are finally getting it you two are finally learning about the lessons that are involved within this connection and it says discover the pattern so i feel like it has to do with um the relationship patterns okay because we are talking about your connection with this person so i feel like it's about um you know when we repeat the same pattern in a relationship and um, we can't get them we can't get ourselves out of it is because we are not learning the lessons behind it and i feel like this has been the case um for the both of you okay so um, basically kind of like um, discovering or finding out okay am I like repeating something that is just not working in a relationship within a relationship okay so uh, these are the energy that I see and let's get um, let's get some actually I think um, for the I don't know if for Aries I got I wanted to actually get some other cards, but I think I forgot. It's okay. Next time I will remember, but I wanted to get more something else for for Aries too. Like I wanted to give you guys some to give them some heart messages too, but I think I forgot. Anyways, let's do this. Let's see what else the spirit is mentioning about your connection with them. Just a second here. Okay. all right um let's see let's see what else is happening here between you and your person spirit please show us what is going on for sagittarius and their person okay we have justice all right and it says justice is concerned with truth and integrity you may find yourself compelled to speak the truth and that um and that you more than ever value honesty and integrity in others this is your person's um energy okay this is the, your person's energy and we also have um, the empress and it says you should embrace your softer side allow yourself to explore the emotions you are feeling and listen to your intuition wow this is beautiful i feel like this is your energy sagittarius okay and um let's get um one for the uh, 
Okay, I think I need one. Let's see if I can get one card for the union and see. Okay, we got it. All right, so we have the moon, okay? And it says something about a situation or a person in your life is not what it appears to be and you need to trust what your instincts are telling you in order to see um, to see past this illusion. Okay, so let's see what is happening here. All right, what I'm seeing here is that and I'm um, sorry guys, I feel like I made a mistake here because I'm seeing like this on their end and this is on your end. Okay. All right, so what is happening um, for your person here is that I feel like your person needs to, um, when it comes to you, they, as I said, they've been feeling very confused, okay? They've been feeling, they've been kind of like drowning in their own emotions, not seeing things clearly. Um, maybe even they thought if they revealed to you how soft they are or how um, they feel towards you, you're going to think that they're weak or they're not very um, perhaps strong, okay? Um, and it says you should embrace your softer side, allow yourself to explore the emotions you're feeling and listen to your intuition. Um, spirit is encouraging your person to listen to their intuition when it comes to the connection. All right. And I feel like they haven't been expressing um, themselves to you. They've been keeping all of these like feelings to themselves, also not revealing who they truly are to you. Okay. Because they've been confused about themselves at the first place. So they couldn't really be maybe honest with you. All right, this is what I'm seeing as their energy. And um, as with your energy, I feel like you um, you're, you were really kind of like perhaps concerned about if your person is honest, are they lying to you? Or um, it says justice is concerned with truth and integrity. So you may find yourself compelled to speak the truth and that you more than ever value honesty and integrity. So I feel like you've been questioning the intention of your person. Okay, you knew that there is feelings here. You knew that, you know, um, there's something going on, but you really thought, you, you really was telling yourself that you want them to be honest with you as opposed to, you know, always like perhaps running away or not being available and all of that. So I feel like this is the time when you are demanding the truth, you're asking for justice. Maybe it hasn't been fair to you. I feel like they, you know, maybe you've been telling them about how you feel, but they've been either running away or not um, expressing anything back to you. Okay, so I feel like this is a time when you are demanding that you want them to be truthful to you, no matter what it is, like if they love you or not, I feel like that's not the case. I feel like you really want to know the truth at, at this time. You really, really value honesty and integrity. I feel like, you know, when it comes to the connection that you have with them. Okay, so the energy of the union, we have the moon. I feel like, um, you know, first of all, of course, this is the energy of uh, Pisces, Cancer. Okay, there's, there's water energy. But mostly what they are telling me here is that both of you could have had some illusion about the connection maybe you had some maybe you you know idealize each other maybe you thought like the relationship is in a certain way or um i feel like overall and so something about a situation or person in your life is not what it appears of course you know the moon they usually talk about illusion but i feel like in this case it's also about you know intuition you know, intuition, like basically um, this person has not been perhaps showing you who they really are. And that's why you thought like maybe they are not honest or um, something is kind of like not seems right with them. Okay. So, um, and what it says is that um, to see past the illusion, like he says, you need to trust your instinct. 
um, are telling you. So I feel like your instinct might be telling you that yes, this person loves you and they have feelings for you, but they have been putting a different kind of a mask, you know, like putting a mask as opposed to like telling you exactly how they feel. I feel like they've been um, not being honest with themselves, okay? Yeah, or they felt like, um, I feel like it's mostly not because they wanted to be dishonest, but because they've been afraid of embracing their softer side, okay? They thought like if they show you that they have that soft side of themselves, then you're going to run away or thinking that this person is just not worthy because they're not maybe masculine enough or strong enough, all right? Okay, so just a second. All right, now, okay, I think that um, this is this. I want to also give you guys um, some heart message, and this is something that I forgot to do for Aries. So, my apologies to Aries, I forgot to do that, but let's get it for the rest of the signs. Maybe if I have time at the end, I will have one for Aries. Maybe I'll post it. Oh my goodness, okay, so Sagittarius, this is your message that is coming and says, a message for you, I'm thinking of you at this very moment, your love fills me with light, I love you, oh my goodness, this is the message from your person, um, Sagittarius, so they do love you and you know that, okay, you know that, they just haven't been expressing that. Yeah, they need to embrace their emotions, their feelings. I feel like your person is someone very sensitive. Um, definitely like a water sign is being showed up. Um, okay. All right, my loves. So, Sagittarius, let's get you guys some charms. And you're done with your quick um, reading. And remember that, um, remember that I'm gonna have it like a little bit short, okay? Because I wanna have it for all the signs. Although I feel like it's between like 15 to 18 minutes for each of the signs. We have the letter M and it also says divine connection, soul bond. We have letter B and uh, we also have union is far but happening there is aquarius energy here yeah definitely aquarius energy okay um yeah what else do we have here we also have an elephant so it could be that um uh for some of you it could be like you leave like somewhere in like asia south asia especially like india could be we also have um libra yeah with the justice there was like libra energy so your person could be a libra uh, we also have letter y okay year of rabbit is also being showed up there is an elephant again so i don't know i'm seeing like india okay or south asia india what is on top of this thing it's getting a little I don't know what happened. I think there's something on it. Anyways, you know, guys, I'm very, like, sometimes fussy about things. Maybe it is. Not sure what it is. <laughs> Anyways, that's okay. All right. Um, so I won't have to, you know, I don't, I'm not going to look for all, everything that is here. But um, we're going to get some of them. We also have Scorpio. Okay, we also have Aquarius. Aquarius, there is a lot of Aquarius energy. So there is like a lot of like star. And there is that a uh, lot of Aquarius energy. There is the cat here. And yeah, okay, what is that? Yeah, for some of you, um, maybe the message is going to be coming like um, in winter or like um maybe it already came like during the christmas maybe they message you you have the moon as well again so i feel like for some of you there is like a, a cancer or pisces energy coming all right and it also says every journey starts with one step okay all right so i think that this is it for you my loves um I am not going to go through all of them, as I said, because I want to um, 
have these readings a little bit shorter i hope that you enjoyed it now we are going to take a little break and i'm gonna go to the next sign which is going to be leo okay my loves so let's get to leo this is going to be the energy reading for my lovely leos and um, i'm going to put it here so that we know this is energy reading for leos i've been trying to keep these um, energy checks uh, pretty short but it didn't happen so i'm really hoping that um, i can have them a little bit shorter <clears throat> however when the messages comes in i just don't uh, i don't stop so we'll see let's see okay let's get to leo's um let's get to your energy <clears throat> and your person's energy and see what is going on leo spirit please show me what is going on for my lovely leos and their divine counterparts what is happening for leos okay so we have a uh, nature uh, nurture connections okay uh, and it says the gray wolf okay so i feel like this is on your end and we have delight in daring okay um <clears throat> this is on their end all right your person could be born in the year of snake for some of you and there's pisces energy too and it says um, navigate life with determination okay so right off the bat i feel like you know what you guys are doing or what is happening within this relationship is going against um the river okay so you know when um the you know when the salmon when the, this fish uh you know when these fish uh fishes they want to go um to the other side of the river they have to struggle a lot or they have to jump really high in order to get to the other side so i feel like you know it has been such a struggle for both of you but you guys are going to be making it okay your energy leo right now is that i feel like you you might have been spending a lot of time with your family with friends or basically like nurturing a lot of um, connections around you now for some of you i feel like you might have not been in a lot of communication with your person maybe you felt like um this person is not take is not putting the time that it's needed for this relationship in order to work so maybe they have been on and off maybe they have been like coming and going and 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 i feel like for leos you decided to kind of like concentrate on people in your life that they are more um present or they are there for you okay so for some of you i feel like you've been nurturing the connections that um kind of like a family friends mostly like family connections that i'm seeing here now what is happening with your person and this is like you know being shown here by the gray wolf here or it says nurture connection so so for some videos that you are watching this i feel like maybe you've been spending a lot of time with family or in a community with other people um and basically i feel like you've been um spending time with everyone except for you know perhaps the person that you have in your heart because i feel like they have they are not present uh, at the moment in your life now what is going on with your person is that i feel like your person is um feeling that they gonna be they're gonna be doing something really daring they're gonna be doing something that is gonna absolutely like shock you okay so something really like shocking they want to do i feel like this person wants to pursue you so badly i feel like they've been wanting to do that for such a long time but because of all of these challenges they thought that maybe they're not going to be able to make that jump to make that kind of like a last kind of like a move of like okay i want this relationship and i'm willing to put some time for it um I feel like the reason for it and the energy of the union that I'm seeing is exactly like this. I mean, it has been a struggle to get on the other side, but you two are going to be making it. Um, you two are going to be jumping and going on the other side of the river or this looks like a waterfall uh, mostly like i feel like but it's like you know when the salmon or these um fishes they want to go to the other side they always have to jump and it's really hard because they are going against the river right because this is the flow of the river now i feel like you two have you know you two are facing a lot of um challenges when it comes to the connection maybe you two are in two different parts of the world you know they're you know you are here they're there and it's really hard or for some of you i'm saying that you two are maybe separated by the ocean or by water there's something that you know they're showing me as well also as i said um there are some spirit animals that are being showed up there's eagle there's wolf and also your person could be born in the year of snake this is another one that i'm seeing um and also pisces is being emphasized here so maybe for some of you this person has pisces in their chart all right and now let's um get more information 
about them okay or about the connection and see what's going on okay um Yeah, I feel like for a lot of Leos, you've been um, spending a lot of time with your tribe, right? Like with your tribe. But I'm seeing like your tribe or your um, soul family or people that you really love. It could be like, you know, your even like your family, friends and... Um yeah, like didn't want to, like wanted maybe this person to take action because I feel like you didn't see a whole lot of things happening with, you know, within the connection. Like you've been telling yourself, like, you know, if nothing happens, then um, you rather focus on other things in your life, which is family and maybe friends. Okay, so let's see what else is going on between your connection um, with you, for you and your loved one. Okay, we have the devil. So for some of you, that could be a Capricorn. And um, we also have the strange. And of course, this is Leo. So, I mean, but remember, guys, that these cards are not traditional tarot cards. So, you know, even like the way that it's being showed up is different. So the strange, of course, always represent Leo. And the devil rep is represented by um, Capricorn. Okay. So, you know, it's very interesting that strange card showed up because this is um, Leo, actually. All right, but um, the way that I'm looking at it is, um, you know, I'm going to see what is the spirit message actually around these cards are because they are not traditional. So I'm going to see what message is. But let me get one more card for the union as well. All right, and we have the magician. Okay, so I feel like you guys have all the tools that you need in order to get in the other side of the river. Like you're going to make it, Leo. You are so going to make it with this relationship, but you don't know now perhaps okay so i feel like um it's just really interesting because this look, looks like look what it says it says mastering raw emotions in order to bring calm to yourself or a situation overcoming the obstacle we face in relation to our own doubts fears and anxieties okay so I feel like for a lot of Leos, you've been able to, in order to manage perhaps a lot of like doubt, a lot of like fear that you have around the relationship, you guys have been using your inner strength and also perhaps um, for some of you, you've been um, trying to focus on yourself and especially as I said, like, you know, um, kind of like getting around the communities or people that are supportive okay or they are present in your life i feel like for a lot of you you are mastering also um your feelings you know the feelings that maybe you have towards this person maybe you have like some fears around it like okay what if this connection will never work out what if i you know i will be alone and all of that so i feel like you've been mastering that in a way and the way that you have managed it is um by supportive people People, by people around you that I feel like Leo you're surrounded by really good people in your life and they're helping you definitely to overcome a lot of obstacles when it comes to your relationship now what is going on with your person um it's it's interesting it says the devil and it says um you are in control of your own destiny and you're not bound by anything other than your attitude or behavior there's always something positive you can do to improve your situation no matter how hopeless things may seem on the surface so you know this is like you know what i'm feeling here is that um this person is feeling like they can do it. They feel that even though, you know, this situation is really seems like hopeless. It really seems like this connection is hopeless and there's no way around it. But this person is feeling like they can, um, they can do it. They're going to do something crazy. As I said, I feel like, you know, either they're going to come to see you or they're just going to, there is going to be traveling involved, Leo. So I feel like this person is going to tell you that they're going to come and see you. And this is, this might shock you or you might, uh, you might have felt like um, this is this will never go anywhere but there is something daring that this person is going to do they're feeling very very um, with the devil of course the devil has that kind of like a negative connotation into it but I'm seeing it actually here as something really positive and I'll tell you why because I feel like this person is feeling really really like passionate towards you and I feel like in a way they feel like they need to do something like they need to make a move like even though maybe a lot of people could be against them or there's a lot of obstacles for you guys i mean i feel like this connection seems like you know perhaps seemed like very like hopeless in the beginning 
but now your person feels like really really positive right now they feel like they can do something about it so and they're gonna do it they're gonna make action towards this connection now um with a magician i feel like both of you are equipped with all the tools that you need to make this happen okay and it says um and it says you have all the skills and attitudes you need to be successful the universe is aligning to bring positive changes your way so i feel like not only um you know you guys are equipped but also i feel like the universe is giving you that push you know the universe is like i don't know bringing like a wave or something to bring these like two fishes like you know um going to the other side so um i feel like um it, it's interesting because the energy of um uh, I'm seeing like some, uh, I'm seeing Greece, I'm seeing like Italy, I'm seeing um, Middle East as well. So there is a lot of like energies like um, coming along here as well. But it's not for all of you guys, but for some of you, I'm seeing that maybe the background or maybe you guys live in different countries, like completely, like seems like the connection seems too like difficult and too like um, hopeless. All right. So but spirit is saying is that your person is definitely um, gonna is feeling like more positive about it even though it might have seemed like really really hard to achieve okay so this is um, what I'm saying for you guys and um, I think like yeah I mean I'm, I'm gonna try to keep these ones um, like maximum like 15 minutes for each um, zodiac sign but sometimes when the messages comes in I don't really uh stop okay so so capricorn yes for some of you could be like this person is a capricorn the energy of capricorn pisces as well was coming up there's also um uh gemini energy but let's get you guys a heart <laughs> okay it says so this is the message that it's coming and it says wait don't rush into it allow nature to take its course so yeah i feel like this is what you're doing actually i feel like you know you're waiting you know you're not maybe rushing into it you're maybe you're letting the universe to take over because um i feel like it took you a lot of inner strength in order to still like stick with the connection okay so this is the message that is coming from spirit like wait for now and let the universe i feel like universe is gonna you know push both of you towards very exactly where you need to be all right now let's get you guys some charms as well and uh, see what's coming all right all ready let's see let's see guys okay yeah, i think i'm gonna get one of these and let's see what is happening here all right so um there is grapes i feel like um i'm seeing like winery or something like that maybe like somebody really loves wine or like grapes is being showed up and says i will tell you how i feel okay and it says i'll see you very soon my love so this person wants to come and see you there is no doubt about it even if you two are living in two different countries i feel like this is what they want to do and it says i was afraid of getting hurt um, couldn't express myself before and uh, it also says i want us to be together okay and um i was afraid of hurting you okay and it says i want to see you again all right all right so and, and and again there is a frog here very very interesting guys because this person wants to oh there was there a frog or not hmm no there was no frog i don't know why i i thought like i saw a frog for some reason but anyways i feel like this person wants to take a leap of faith because frogs are associated with um taking a leap of faith why was i seeing a frog i don't know hmm very strange but anyways um i feel like this person wants to take a leap of faith we have friends um especially paris is being showed up yeah oh my god there's an airplane this person is coming to see you leo there is no doubt about it that you're gonna see them and um, it also says i'm frustrated right now can't talk i feel like maybe um this was the last message that you got from them. maybe they were frustrated with something i feel like they've been frustrated with all the difficulties that the connection has been bringing um oh my god there's a fish here so there is pisces okay um if your person is a pisces then definitely this is a strong strong um 
confirmation for you guys and i also feel like this person wants to have a family life with you so their intention is that they want to have a family life they don't want to uh, they don't want to fool around. They don't want to like this person is quite traditional as well. They want to have you know they want to um, have a family life with you like a house, okay? So maybe um, this is something in their mind. They want to do some. Maybe they want to like buy a house or something about that is coming. Okay, and um, we also have um, a music note. So it could be that one of you are musically talented, but also I feel like the messages are might be coming to you via music. So pay attention to that. Um, we also have letter, letter Q, I believe. We have letter Q. Okay, so your person could have that. And we also have the, the ladybug. So I feel like you are going to be very, very lucky when it comes to love. Very, very lucky. Even though maybe in the past you thought like that's not the case at all. But I feel like you guys are going to be very lucky in love. And um, yeah, I mean, we have the trees. And um uh, it says life is a gift this is beautiful uh, because i feel like the you know the connection that you have with this person is like deeply rooted in your souls i feel like you two are old souls and um and with the roots or with the trees um i feel like this person wants like this person is gonna be like part of your family okay you two are gonna have a family life together this is what i'm seeing there's also <clears throat> a message so i feel like they are going to message you okay you might be receiving a message from them as well all right my loves there's also an ice cream i don't know maybe both of you love like um ice cream that is also being showed up and in terms of like places um france is being showed up or paris is being showed up okay my lovely <clears throat> Leo's this was your reading I hope that you enjoyed it and remember that I'm also going to have the individual readings uh, soon after this as well and um, which there is going to be extension on my membership site as well so um, I'm also going to have um, the yearly forecast for all the zodiac signs on my membership site soon as well I'm just really really catching up because I'm so behind but um, I hope that I can catch up uh, this week with um, all the readings that um, I need to do. Okay, so I'm going to take a short break and then I'm going to get into the next um, round of signs, which is going to be um, earth signs. Okay, and we are going to start with Capricorn. Okay. <laughs> 